hired a car this morning from Rome and we drove to Pompeii, did a Pompeii tour and then we've just arrived in Positano and the drive here was amazing. You're basically like on a cliff looking over the Amalfi Coast which is beautiful. A little bit scary, kind of like on a cliff and there's like huge buses trying to get past you and definitely felt like my life was about to end a few times but we're here now and it is amazing. The place we are staying is a little Airbnb and I've got this beautiful little courtyard, well, corridor, hallway. So this is the like the front gate and then this window is actually my room which I will show you when I get around and you walk out. It's a little bit cloudy but oh, still beautiful. And then all the restaurants are like there and <laughs> we're all the way up here. So I think we have to like go out, go down all these steps and somehow get there. Literally have a basil plant, some thyme, maybe sage, oregano and a cute little strawberry bush, some flowers and then just casually an amazing view and we've even got a lemon tree we've got these two doors comes in oh oh you're decent it's all good little kitchen little table little lounge room which is a little bit eccentric to say the least a little bit colorful and then this one's my bathroom my room which, yeah, has this little window. What? This is mum and dad's room. And they've got this cute little terrace thing, would you say? Yeah. It's like a little mini. It's cute. Their bathroom is a bit more spacious. Big old mirror and then just, it's kind of a bit random with the shower, isn't it? Yeah, I went to look around the corner. <laughs> So we're definitely going to be able to get some awesome Instagram photos. Um, well, we're here. We're here for four days. So this will be the Positano vlog. I've been so fucking lazy with my makeup. I've literally just been kind of like topping it up with powder. I've put some lippy on tonight and I'm kind of wearing... Beautiful skirt, little crop top denim jacket because it is a little bit chilly not super chilly but a little bit um went for some hoops and it has cleared up a bit actually i feel like it's gotten lighter which is weird so we're just gonna go for a dinner um i think it's just one that's close to our airbnb because we are all knackered from a lot of walking over the last two days and then tomorrow we're doing a trip to Capri, so that'll be awesome. In an um, unexpected turn of events, we got rained on. So it's still raining this morning. We are off to Capri, but this is the weather. Still beautiful, but a bit unfortunate.
are just wandering the streets of Positano, which are cute and quaint, but they're bloody steep stairs and we're fucked. <laughs> Okay, so a little catch up. So yesterday I didn't film heaps because we woke up and it was torrential rain and we had a kind of trip booked to Capri. But yeah, it was pissing down with rain. So we literally had to walk down. We couldn't figure out the bus system. We tried to get on this bus like a little bit down and basically they were like, no ticket, no bus. And we were like, what? And we just didn't know what to do. So we were like, fuck it, let's just walk. We're already wet. We were soaking. Everything was just soaked. We were like walking down the stairs and it was literally like a river at our feet, like flowing down this cliff. It was a long way. So that wasn't fun. And yeah, it took ages. It took like half an hour and they're like that. So today our calves are like steel. They burn. We're all like limping and... <laughs> just pretty funny so anyway we got a boat over to Capri which was really nice again it was a bit cloudy but it cleared up a little bit um, the views were really nice it was like very quaint little streets it was a cute little island then we got the boat back 
had a bit of a nap slash rest. Then we had dinner at this Michelin star restaurant. I had a $60 steak, which was amazing, but a lot of money. And it was just a really nice restaurant. Um, we saw some nice views. Then today we went to Sorrento. Um, again, kind of weird, like we had to drive there. And when we first got there, we were kind of really unsure like where to go. It was really dead. Like we got there early so we could park, but it was just really dead and like there was no one around. And we weren't really sure like where we could get a nice view from. And like, it was just a bit weird. We stopped to have like coffee and cake and stuff, which is like our favorite thing to do. And then we had another wander back to like the main square and it started getting more busy. Um, we saw this kind of ruin. It was called the Villa de Mill. Something about mills. And it's like this old abandoned concrete, creepy looking mill. Um, and it's like down in this valley and you can look down in it and it's all overgrown It's like my favorite kind of building like I froth buildings like that that are abandoned and they're just so creepy So that was cool and then we ended up going back down the streets We'd been down and they were just suddenly really busy packed with tourists everything was open So we were like, oh, okay mustn't kick off till like 10 and then we found the best viewpoint got some amazing views and then we kind of thought like well Sorrento is nice, but like we'd prefer to have lunch at Positano because we haven't had a chance to see Positano in the sun. So we all were like, yeah, let's go back there. So we came back here, worked out the buses. <laughs> I kind of read the instructions a bit better and we ended up working out how to get the bus, which was pretty cheap. Took us all the way down to the main square near the beach and we had lunch there and it was just so lush down there like it's so again really cute little street and now we're just back kind of just chilling i think they're having a nap um we're all pretty dead from just all the stairs we've been walking and i'm just having a little lounge in the sun and on the balcony with an amazing view we also bought heaps of kind of food from like a little supermarket like little bits of meat and cheese some beers some prosecco so we're just gonna have little nibbles and stuff and then go for dinner later mm -hmm. 